I have always wanted to have an aesthetic and functional desk setup to help improve my productivity. And this is what my desk setup has looked like recently. So it's definitely time for a makeover. I am so grateful to have an entire office room at my new apartment. So in this video, I'm gonna be organizing, decorating, and setting up this entire room in order to make it the perfect space to work in. I've had this desk and these Alex nine drawers for a while. So I'm gonna keep these and focus on putting new decorations and organizing organizing everything. And this is what the rest of my office room looks like. This mirror I'm so obsessed with and I'm hoping that after I have everything put together in the background, this will be like one of my new favorite outfit mirrors. Next to it, I have this shelf, which I definitely wanna go through and make sure it's all a little bit more organized. This is one of my favorite parts of the room. It has all my art books in a stack with one of my favorite lamps on it. Over here is my desk area, which I showed you guys. And this is like the main spot we're gonna be focusing on in this video. I have a closet over here, which is great for all of my paintings and art storage. And then my couch, and I feel like this is the perfect spot because I actually sit on it, and it fits perfectly right here with everything else. One of the best parts though of this office room is having its own bathroom. I am so grateful for this. It is so nice because especially when I'm editing all day, I don't have to go upstairs or go in my room to use the bathroom. So this is what we are starting out with. I am so excited to see the full transformation. I have a list of things that I wanna get for this video. So I have been online shopping all today and yesterday trying to pick out things that are gonna be perfect for this space. Mostly I've been shopping on Ikea, Urban Outfitters, and Amazon. A lot of you guys have requested that I make an Amazon storefront, so I finally did. I will be back in probably a week to give you guys a haul once everything gets here. I have barely had the patience to not open every single one of these boxes because I've been so excited with everything coming in for this video. don't even know where to start. The first thing that I bought is this mat to go right on top of my desk. And I got it in this really cute pink color. It literally matches my shirt perfectly. This color is so pretty. I have seen these all over Pinterest and I am so obsessed. I cannot wait to decorate this and fill it up. So I think I'm gonna put it in this corner. There's gonna be like an entire section of this video just dedicated to decorating my pegboard. I bought a bunch of little things to go with it. This cute little shelf, a cup, two hooks, these cute little clips. And then these, I guess they're little mini hooks. I cannot wait to put all this stuff together. This next thing was a little bit unnecessary. Oh my gosh. This is just the cutest little tile coaster. I just love it so much. I think this is the color chocolate covered strawberry, which made me like it even more. So I am so excited to put this on here. Oh, for like my drink when I'm editing. I can already envision it, so this is so cute. I have all the pieces to build a little wooden two-tiered shelf, and I have all the pieces to build a little laptop holder. As you can see in the picture, I don't know how to describe it. As you guys know, I love my salt lamp in my room, and when I saw this, I got so excited. So this is a salt lamp nightlight. It's actually such a big piece of salt. It comes with the light bulb and then the plug-in. I'm thinking to have this right here on my late night editing days is gonna be so cute. I mean, we got all the essentials in this video, right? Next, I got this big wall shelf. It took me forever to pick this one out, and I think it's gonna be perfect. My plan is to put it right above me on the wall, so we have a lot of building to do in this video. This next thing makes me so excited. So I only bought one poster because I have a lot of posters and prints already ready for my last apartment. This one is so cute. I did not realize how small it was. We're gonna make it work. It's still so cute. This is the last thing I got. This is the cutest little wall hook. I bought it to go on this side of the room because we're doing the entire office setup. It actually matches the one in my bathroom, which is so cute. So over the next couple days, we are gonna be transforming this space. I am so excited to see how it turns out. 10 out of 10 purchases.
my entire desk setup. Especially when I paint, it always gets everywhere. So I'm so excited to start now with a clean base on all of my furniture. I think first I'm just gonna start setting things up and placing things around just to get an idea of what it's gonna look like on my desk. Oh my gosh, how cute is this already looking? I love seeing all the colors together and all of the main pieces that are gonna be here. Obviously the pegboard is gonna be on the wall and so is the poster, but I think just filling in the gaps a little bit is helping me to decide where I want everything to go. I am so happy with all my choices of the pink and the wood and then this little tile coaster, I feel like brings everything together. The salt lamp nightlight is probably the cutest thing. I am so happy with this purchase. And then you guys know how absurd obsessed I am with wood furniture, so getting this little shelf and then the computer stand is perfect. As I'm putting together my new apartment, it's really important to me to reuse everything that I've already purchased in the past. So like this lamp, some of the decorations, my desk, my Alex9 drawers, and more of the things you're gonna see as I put this entire room together. These are all things I already had, and it feels so good to repurpose these things and reuse them over and over. coming back to you guys a couple days later and as you could tell I have changed my hair color I'm gonna tell you guys all about it in my upcoming video but I wanted to address the appearance change I don't know how I feel about it I'm pretty much back to my natural color it's honestly crazy it's kind of taken me the week to like get used to it a little bit but anyway moving on look at this background I am so obsessed with how my desk is coming together I've taken the last couple days to hang up shelves all around this room it took a couple attempts like there are a lot of holes in my wall that I've been covering up with posters, which was the plan anyway. I am so obsessed with how this entire desk setup is looking. Just the colors together, like the pink and the white and then the wood. So as I've talked about, this is where I want my main workspace to be, especially for editing my videos. So I want this to be very functional and organized, but I also want it to be aesthetic and cute. I feel like that's what's gonna draw me into this room to start working. So I first am gonna work on how I wanna organize these shelves and then I also want to put up some wall art like some posters pictures prints this is one of my prized possessions I'm sure you guys know what this is I got it when I reached 100,000 subscribers on this channel and I'm manifesting the 1 million to come soon I would love to add that to the desk setup So I'm obsessed with this print. I also have these prints that I got from my last apartment. These are some of my favorite pictures. This one's from a photo booth. And then this is a Polaroid of my boyfriend and I two years ago on our five year. I also have this really nice framed print. And then this one, which I got specifically for this video. So of course that has to go up. The thing is, I am literally the most indecisive person. So I will go back and forth on all these things all day and still not have an answer of where I wanna put everything. It took me forever to literally put up three things, but I'm very happy with the progress. It is finally time to start decorating my pegboard. I am so excited. I have literally been waiting this entire video to do this. I feel like this is gonna really pull everything together. Um, so I have seen so many inspiration pictures on Pinterest. I definitely want it to be practical, so I wanna put some supplies on here I can just reach for and easily use when I'm at my desk. But I also want it to be a place to decorate and put really cute things. So I have all of these bins and hooks in front of me. So I have a shelf. This this cup, two hooks, five mini hooks, and then these two cute clips. So I'm gonna use all of these and I'm just gonna see where they fit best because I can change it up as many times as I want. There's like a million different ways I can have this organized. So it's gonna be so fun to change it up whenever I want to. So let's get started. Here is 
what it is looking like right now. So I have a good arrangement of things. A lot of these are supplies that I use at my desk. So I have this cup literally filled with these mechanical pencils. These are the best ones. I have my scissors and then some hand sanitizer, phone charger, my AirPods, my headphones. And then I put up a couple decorations, some photos, prints, and a sticker. For the most part, I know I'm gonna use all of this stuff. It looks pretty nice. I'll probably rearrange it like four more times before it's finalized, but this is a good start. Honestly, it's hard to figure out exactly what I wanna put on here. I feel like once I start sitting at this desk and using it, I'm gonna be like, okay, what am I reaching for the most? Like, that's what I'm gonna put over here. Look, I'm sitting at my desk. Like, this is the new background. This room is feeling so clean and so complete. I'm gonna work on the rest of my room. I have a couple things to pick up and a couple more things to put on my walls. Once I have that completely finished, I'm gonna give you the final tour of what this room is looking like and show you my desk setup. start to put together the rest of this room starting off with the walls so as you can see I have this shelf up and for the rest of the walls I really want to have up more of my artwork especially because I want this workspace to be also where I'm painting and doing all of my art so I feel like it's gonna be so motivating to see my own paintings on the wall So I just reorganized this shelf, specifically the top three shelves to make it a lot less cluttered. I feel like it looks 10 times better. I just wanted it to be very clean. I mainly wanted to put a lot of my crystals on here that aren't at my desk setup, my incense, a couple books, and then I have these two baskets. This is filled with pictures and this is filled with candles. I literally just cleared this entire space for the last like 30 minutes. It looks so good. The floor is completely clean clean. Honestly, I'm kind of liking the empty space. I feel like I don't usually have a lot of wall space like this. And this entire section of my room, I feel like is so cohesive. It looks so good. I also added this rug and I feel like it brought everything together. I also have been working on organizing all of the drawers in my Alex 9 drawer. I have my markers drawer, paints drawer, pens and pencils drawer. I added this painting that I did so long ago, but I just love the colors of it. And then one of my favorite pictures of my sister on the cutest eight ball stand. I have my jewelry and then this heart picture. I am loving how this shelf looks. Also super random, but I just tucked the cord from this lamp behind my shelf and it just made this entire section look 10 times better. It's the small things that make a huge difference. So I am putting the final touches on this desk setup. I cannot believe how far we've come in this video. Like I remember so well, it was kind of a while ago. I've been filming this video for a couple weeks. The before of this desk setup is crazy because it looks so put together and so good. I'm gonna add the final touches. I decided to be so extra for this video and get a new iPad case because I love this green one, but it just doesn't go with this aesthetic. This one, on the other hand, it matches perfectly. Like, as you could tell, this was a justified purchase. And it also matches like everything I own. Like my phone case, this top, my headphone case, my new mat, it's just perfect. It's meant to be. So here is my iPad. This is one of the final touches for this video. I literally have been waiting for this case to come in the mail because I wanted to finish off this video with this last thing. Oh my God. I actually love this one too. Look how pretty my iPad is. I don't know if you can tell what my favorite color is by this video. Like stop. And then the pen goes right here. I'm in love. I am gonna set everything up. We are gonna put this desk together and I'm gonna give you the final tour of this room. I 
I literally have a pink one of these, but I can't find it. We're gonna have to go with lavender. I am so in love with this setup. I cannot believe this is my new office room. I am so incredibly grateful to have this space to work in. I honestly never thought that I would have something like this, like a dedicated room just for me. This is the best thing ever. This is literally my new favorite part of my apartment. I'm gonna be down here all the time. So this is how my desk came out. I added an iced lavender latte, my favorite, to really complete this look. Um, yeah, I wanted the full effect of what it's really gonna look like working down here. I have my laptop on my new stand, my iPad in its new case, matching wallpapers, very cute. And then my phone here too, which just matches the entire aesthetic also. My pegboard is coming along. It really is. It's looking cute so far. I also am loving the decorations. My mindset when I've been putting together this desk setup was I didn't want it to feel too overwhelming. I wanted it to be cute and aesthetic, but if there is too much going on, I'm not gonna be able to focus that well. So with all these decorations and these posters, I kept that in mind and I feel like it came out perfect. There's a lot of blank space, but honestly my focus is right here like on the table and there's nothing to really distract me. So I love that. I gotta pat myself on the back for that because I usually fill up the space when it's here. But also for the rest of the room, I did the same thing. I was really thinking I want it to be simple. I want it to be open and clean. I wanna be able to move around here without tripping over anything or without anything on the floor. So I literally got everything put away and it feels so good. I'm already like the energy in here is amazing. It feels so productive. I really wanna come in here and just get things done. I love the setup too though. So like I can't wait to film so many videos in here. It is just absolutely 10 out of 10. So that is it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching and staying until the end. I'm gonna be posting all this stuff on Instagram and TikTok. So definitely follow me on there if you aren't already. I love you all so much. This would not be possible without you. I am just so grateful every single day to have such a supportive audience. I will see you guys soon in my next video. I can't wait to keep you guys updated on this room and show you like new improvements and things that I'm changing. This is also gonna be such a part of my routine. So every time you watch my morning routine and night routine, I'm gonna have this room featured like every time. I will see you guys soon. Bye. Mwah.